Hello, hello, and welcome to my Outbound Eve series. Join me as I challenge myself by playing One-Handed Spear and Only Corrupted to eventually be able to afford to buy premium. Yeah, damn. Hello there, guys, and pff, fuck me, bro. I'm already just gonna say it. I died like 10 times before I got my first win in the Corrupted today. It is really a bad day for me. I lost like a million, or maybe like a little bit more than a million just like hopping in and going, all right, now I'm gonna do some uh, do some CDs, you know. Hopefully, uh, continue the good day I had the the, the previous day. And uh, nope, died four like wait, yeah, ten times. And then I finally got my first win, and it was a lucky for me. It was a big kill because I was about to quit. I was about to say, all right, I failed the challenge. I'm just gonna go miss now because it would take me like two days to get premium from miss. Just do a bunch of abbeys or you know clearing camps, do the abbeys, form a bunch of uh, favor, and then bada boom, you know we got ourselves premium but instead i'm like sitting here like torturing myself doing corrupted with the spear and um yeah no i died 10 times with the normal spear and i was like yeah i think maybe it's time to put to like uh, swap weapons so I, I started using the uh, daybreaker just because it has that extra purge it's basically the same thing as, as the one-handed spear but it purges when you dash through them with your e and it's also a further dash so i can actually catch some of these like chill hell players and my God, have I been facing a little chill house today, and it's just the most annoying shit to do, because you always gotta save your E, or save some kind of, like, mobility for when they use their, um, the actual E, the chill hell E, and it's like, or you, you pop a reflect when they pop, they, when they use it, you know, and it's just, uh, and then they just kite you, they use their cultist robe, they get their health back, and there's, like, nothing you can do, nothing I can do to stop them. I wish, I know, that's the thing I'm missing right now, this build would still be insane, if only I had access to the last two abilities on the on the uh, spear, the one the one that little the spear that comes from uh, like below the ground, because that works well with what I have right now with a bunch of cooldown reduction and like damage, and I could use that to it's like a slow as well, so I could use that and plus my Q pokes to just like you know kite somebody out and out damage them because I, I did fight another guy using Daybreaker and he basically had those abilities, so I was like, you know. If only had those as well, then it was just about who can land their their uh, their shit better, and then you know who's got the better like uh, off hands for the like tap root or something. You know, this is a bunch of stuff that goes into it. But yeah, I, I'm missing those two abilities to really go ham on this daybreaker build. And uh, yeah, I mean, that, there's not much to say. I just died a lot today. I did get some really big kills though, which is what I'm highlighting here. Like this is only highlights. And, um, yeah, I don't know what else to say is I have, I have a massive fucking headache. I was just trying to grind this out as quick as possible, even though I lost, like, 20 games probably in total. I lost 20 games, but it won 7, and those few wins in there actually made it worth it, because I got a couple million from some of these kills, which was just all I needed. So, yeah, I'm not going to go too much. Like I said, my head is killing me right now. I need to, like, you know, take a shower, cool off, and just go to rest a bit, because I am dying right now. But hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of it. And I'll catch you in the next one.
talking about. Oh. 